Yo, this is Terrell, Hall of Fame, D-Line, and these are Bully Rants. Uh, Y'all work with me. I'm trying something different here. Uh, I have several different banners, as I'm finding out. Some of them have glares off of them, so might not be able to use them. But this one was actually a very nice one uh, made by Jess Lee. And it actually has the uh, Hall of Fame logo really big and Bully Rants across the... Not Hall of Fame, I'm sorry, D-Line, but it does have a Hall of Fame logo on there. <laughs> but uh, anyway, uh, these, you know, <clears throat> upcoming weeks we'll be doing a lot of different things. Not only more stuff with Bully Rants, but a lot more with D-Line Radio. And I will be putting the uh, link to D-Line Radio on here for everybody who's on YouTube who's been following me. You know, to call in or you can listen to the, uh, the playbacks. We'll be getting a lot of guests and... Um, you know, different people in the American bully community will try to make uh, it more informational, not just opinion-wise, but, uh, you know, get some judges on here, get some old school guys, get some new people who are showing, and try to get a different perspective overall as far as to, uh, <clears throat> and I don't say this uh, in jest or anything, but just to fix what's going wrong with the American bully community and some of the things that we see out here. Uh, you know, tonight's show, basically we're going to go into just the show scene. We're going to discuss things as should judges, you know, uh, basically should judges allow people that they're closely related to, whether it's a friend, a girlfriend, family member, you know, uh, certain people who are part of the same groups, should they judge their dogs and does that show a conflict of interest or any conflict of interest. We're going to also talk about dress code and ring attire as far as um, how do people represent the breed as far as you know how they showcase themselves you go to some of the other bigger registries and you see how those people dress and uh, it's very very professional now when we were starting the ABKC you never that wasn't our goal you know it was more of a relaxed thing but I think relaxed in some cases have went sort of overboard and we'll be talking about that and yeah one of the crazy puppies are barking but uh, we'll be talking about a lot of different things, you know, uh, from dog structure, what we see being picked in the ring, is there a debate, is, are the judges picking towards the standard, or do you feel like that the judges are doing more of their own thing? I always hear that some judges are a lot better than others, and you'll always have that, but it's a it's an open, unbiased discussion. You know, feel free to call in and, um, you know, let's talk about these shows, let's talk about you know the dogs at the shows and a way to make the breed better because we can't forget that it was always intended for the breed to be better and to be elevated and more recognized as a true breed and we're still on that mission so I look forward to hearing from y'all tonight. Peace.